<clears throat> Hello. Today, all I'm going to be doing is a comedy where I just talk to a black screen. Yes, a black screen. But why can't it be white? Yeah, I'm not racist. Trust me. Um, It's just not white because... Uh, uh, if, you, if you really start blaming me for being a racist in the comments, then I'll let that... Um, uh, I'll make it a white screen next time. But if not, I'll keep it black. All right, let's get into this. So, I'm going to be talking about a time that... Mm. Oh, yeah, the time I got in trouble for something stupid. So, it was Memorial Day, I think. It was a Monday. I wake up get ready, and school's out, so I go to, I had a summer camp the year before, this, the, 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 what happened took, is taking place in 2022, but I had a summer camp in 2021, that's also like an afternoon place, or like a daycare, so I stayed there, I went there, I was having fun, I was reading a book, we went outside to play basketball, it was fun, um, So, I remember we took a vote what to bake, because we were going to cook something. It was like cupcakes, something else, like ice cream. We ended up making like a brownie or something. They were really good. After we were done, we were just there. I was reading. It was a big Nate book. It, w- it was really funny. Um... There was a code. I remember. I was like, I kept asking Miss Becca, "Hey, hey, Miss Becca, can you help me? Can you help me make this code? Like, figure it out?" Because I had a code. She would help. Um, I bring the book outside too when we play basketball, because it was a really good book. Anyways, I decided. Well, no, they decided we're gonna go on a hike today, so we went to a hike. And we were throwing rocks. It was really fun. We tried to skip rocks. But then, also, one of the rules was walk smartly and don't step in the creek. Because we were near a creek, right? I I was doing both those things. But while I was walking, because there was, like, right near the creek, was just a little entrance thing. That we had to pass through. All the other kids were doing it. That's where the line was. This is, Tell me if this was walking smartly. I walked the exact same way they were walking. The, the teachers, the counselors. They were walking that way even. So I do it as well. Except my foot accidentally slips into the creek. They said, don't step in the creek, the water. Yeah, I know, I wasn't trying to. And they said, walk smartly. I was. That's up to you on that. Tell me if I have a comment section, because I know it's been getting disabled, if that was walking smartly, the way everybody else was doing it. So I remember nobody saw. So I just took my foot out. It was in the water for two seconds, like, splash, bop. I bring it back up. So, one kid, he's not a teacher, but he actually doesn't listen most of the time. I heard one of the kids say, Hey, Miss Becca, Luke stepped into the creek. No, 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 it was Miss Michelle. They said, Hey, Miss Michelle, Luke stepped into the creek. And I found out later is this kid named Marco, but so Miss Michelle, she goes crazy. She's like, Luke, what did I say? I said, don't step in the creek and walk smartly. Yeah, she, she didn't get the full story. She said, go sit out. You're not skipping rocks today. Now me being the goody goody, uh, am, uh, I cried about it. I was, 
Crystal is stupid. And you're in a slip and fall call. 1-800-LUNDY-LAW. Yeah, I, I, I was injured mentally in a slip and fall. So I'm calling 1-800-LUNDY-LAW. And I'm going to go to court with this lady. Now, she we ended up... She didn't apologize or anything. She didn't realize she did something wrong. But she... She, um, she was nice, but, like, not too much. She she says she cares about the kids, and she, she does, but she cares mainly about herself. I can tell. I can tell. So, that's one story. I think I'll have time for one more story. Then I will, you know... Just leave, and I'll let you watch the video. So let me think about a story. I'm going to cut the video here, and then I'll think about a story. All right, I'm back, and I thought of another story. So this is me being the two times champions of a game with fourth graders. I'm a fourth grader. I teamed up with a sixth grader. All right. So it was a game... Where we were going in two circles. The inner circle was going clockwise. The outer circle was going... I forget what you call it. Not clockwise. Um, Yellow with white. Um, Sorry. So, we had to find our... It was whoever lasts, lasts to the end, Um, they win. And I ended up winning two times. So... The the teacher would call out an action, and whoever got did the action last would lose. So me and my partner were hyped about this because she, my partner was a she. She was the biggest one in there, bigger than one of the counselors. She was strong too. So one of them would hold us on, hold someone on their back. I was like, I'm definitely not having her on my back. She's the tallest. She's the she's the biggest one in the room. I'm I'm not having her on my back, so I had to get on her back. We we were doing a lot of stuff: the tube, the pool noodle, the life vest. So yeah, we ended up making it to the final two with two kids, Justin and Jarrell. So me and this girl Brio, we were competitive against them. But it was life jacket that overcome, which is the one to get on someone's back. I got on her back. Jarrell tripped and fell, so we won. And we got a prize. We were one times champions. First game we've played. Then we took a break, did our small groups, and we had time for one more game. Me and Brielle were doing good. We kept saying we got this in the bag, but we knew we probably weren't going to win. But guess who it came down to? The final two came down to me, Brielle, versus Justin and Jarrell. So we were face-to-face -face again. And guess what the teacher called out? Just like last time, final two. It, she called out life jacket. And I got on Brielle's back. And Jarrell tripped. It fell. I know. Hold on, I'm playing basketball in a mini hoop. Yeah, it was crazy. So that is how I became two times champion with my friend. It was crazy. All right. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, well, then I recommend watching some of my other videos. I don't care. You don't have to like. I'm not in it for the likes. I'm in it to entertain you. And get money. Um, yeah, but I'm in it to entertain. 
it's not pretty entertaining with just a black screen, though. I'll make it white next time so that you don't call me racist, racist. He's a racist. No. All right. I hope you have a good day. And always remember to aim high, work hard, and be kind. See you next time. Also, remember to sh um, share the troll face to your friends. And say, this is for... And say, this is Team L. Share the troll face. Okay, have a great day. Bye.